Gideon father gets his daughter a no religion, no caste certificate. In uh, um, Ahmedabad, India, an Indian father, Ra uh, Rajveer, fought relentlessly so that his 13-year-old daughter's school issued a graduation certificate that left the religion and caste columns blank. The father's last name will also not be included on the certificate so that uh, so as not to reveal the family's caste and to avoid discrimination. He argued that on the basis of a previous court ruling that declared that Hinduism is not a religion but a way of life, that it therefore follows that Hinduism should not be included in the religion category of his daughter's certificate. It was pretty genius if you ask me. Uh, last year, uh, Rajveer had also filed a plea in the Jugarat High Court seeking to get the status Look of an that. atheist. Thank you. <laughs> um, seeking to get the status of an atheist on his own files. That case is still ongoing. The, the whole, re this is just a way of life, not a religion, just backfired on these people. Yes, that's awesome. <laughs> he fought this case by himself. It's awesome. Oh, wow. That's yeah. awesome. Yes, that's, that's the reason I wanted to like really include this news. Like, really love this guy. This is the third time, to my knowledge, someone has tried to do this. And the second time, to my knowledge, that Hinduism is just a way of life has backfired. The first time was like when a high court said, like someone like uh, made some complaints against an artist saying that this is defi uh, defiling our religion or something like that, uh, uh, vilifying our religion. And the high court just said, oh, but Hinduism is a way of life. They cannot vilify your religion if it's not a religion. <laughs> so, but it, just, just to, love me. I just yeah. want to be clear to people. Um, yes, Hinduism is a way of life and it's a religion. Those two things are not mutually exclusive. And yes, it is a way of life. It's a shitty, barbaric, ancient, racist way of life that needs to die. So, yeah, just uh, just because something is a way of life, that doesn't mean, oh, yeah, oh, great, it's a way of life. So, it's, yeah, so it's racism. But go ahead. Uh, what I want to say, like, this is the third case. And the first case was, like, last year, uh, around February, uh, this girl got uh, no religion, no caste certificate, and she was successful. And she already had a job and everything. So, was, uh, so she was fine legally from legal actions, but she had to face a lot of threats and abuse for what she did. Because, like, not having caste is like, um, I mean, if you go out, because that is the most horrible thing you can do, according to Hinduism. Like, the most... Uh, it's, uh, I mean, hell, there are tortures in the hills in Hinduism, but outside the hills, that's the most horrible thing. Like, if you murder someone, or if you like, if you kill a Brahmin, or if you eat beef, kind of uh, things like that, then you will be considered as an outcast. Uh, so that's the most horrible thing you can do. And that's why she had to face like lots of social backlash and everything. And the second guy who also tried to do it last year, uh, got successful a few months after like uh, applying for it, but then within a month, the high court withdrew their uh, withdrew the certificate, saying, "Oh no, we can't give it to you." So he wasn't like successful at, uh, finally, but I think he's still trying to do it. And this is like the third case, and he's again successful for now. But we don't know. Like the girl, her, his daughter, she's just thirteen, uh, so she may face a, sh a social backlash as it grows up. Oh, that sucks. I hope she doesn't. Uh, again, this is these are the people that are normal, like doing like they're taking a lot of heat, and there's gonna there's gonna be by a fo followed by a whole bunch of people that are gonna be benefiting from from these people without actually, and a lot of them are not even gonna appreciate it, right? These are people at the front lines that are making the difference, that are that are making changes that a shit ton of other people are going to be enjoying the new normal after them. Uh, the, there's something like this hypocrisy I saw on Twitter. Like there have been celebrities congratulating these people for like uh, going for the secularism way, but these celebrities like when the when the first like the girl when she got the no religion no caste certificate for herself uh, she was the first one she said that anyone 
who can afford it because some people has the caste certificate like i mentioned in the previous news like if you are of a lower caste you have the certificate to get certain benefits like not everyone can just afford to like leave their caste because you are so poor that you need some kind of benefits to get a job even get a job or get a good education uh, but mm. if anyone can afford it they should go for this way but this celebrities they can afford it they can do whatever they want and they are congratulating her but they don't do anything like this they don't go and apply for like a no caste certificate or anything uh, that's like another thing and this, this is one thing like she said about it like if you really consider india as a secular country then why can't indians be seculars like why do we have to choose a religion why can't if india is a secular country why can't we be considered as seculars why do we have to choose a religion and she does have a point mm. uh, by the way soraya is mentioning in live chat that this man uh, is um, is not a dalit so his experience is still a mild one um yeah i mean Obviously, it would have been a lot worse if he was a Dalit, but but he, he probably is taking some heat anyways. And um, it would have been a lot worse if he wasn't if he was a Dalit. But yeah, fair point. Um, okay, so that was our last news. Do you guys want to add anything? Because I have something to say to our live chat before. Okay, before I wanted go. to say yeah. another thing about this man because, yeah. like in India, if you are not given, if you don't have a like given title from the Mughals or the British in your family as your family last name. then you have a hindu surname which can determine your caste uh, which by which people can determine your caste so many people live in the fear that uh, if they reveal their surnames others will know what their caste is and they might face discrimination which also happens in the us by the way many employees they fear that if they reveal their surnames they might face discrimination so this guy actually also tried to drop his surname and got inspired by elon musk and just <laughs> made some random letters and numbers i i don't know i uh, remember what the mean exactly but he wanted to have those letters and numbers as a surname instead of having a hindu surname just so people cannot identify his caste at all and yeah, also was... this this another guy whose application got rejected uh, for being an atheist he just changed his surname to atheist So literally, yeah. I'm a now. Guys, I we, because people are leaving, I have to make sure I announce this before people leave. Okay, so mm-hmm. is that the okay? Are you done with the news, right? Yes. Okay. So guys, I'm um I'm um in the in the description, you could see how to follow Susanna on Twitter. I'm also included how to include Shopam personally on. all of his on youtube twitter instagram myself my personal accounts in there rifka i haven't included rifka yet because she just sent me her personal uh, facebook page so i'm going to include that one right uh, shortly after this as well but if you interested in anyone pers- like here like if you want to follow susanna or shabhan uh, or contact them personally or rifka uh, i'm going to show you how to follow everybody uh, it's at the very is right before the sources for every news that we cover um so yeah right on top of that close to the end but above the sources so you that's where i'm going to include that so go ahead and follow your favorite person here uh, and also atheist Rep- you can follow atheist republic and everywhere as well so that's all uh, rifka is here <laughs> yes follow rifka you, on her facebook page i'm going to go you can follow me uh, here as well on it's my new the- account at atheist ronnie Yeah, the link is in the description. Uh, right now, Rifka is not there. So uh, right after this, I'm going to try to add uh, Rifka as well. So, yeah. I can't hear you, Rifka. You're muted. I knew I was muted, but I was saying, it's the anti-Semitism. It's the anti-Semitism. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I wasn't a- ready. <laughs> Okay, that's that's great. Okay, guys, love you all. Thank you, people in the live chat. Thank you, Soa. Soa is saying, please like. Oh, Soa is always reminding everybody to please like and subscribe. Yes, thank you so much, Soa. Please like and subscribe. Please, please, please like and subscribe. Thank you so much, guys. You know, we say con- uh, very controversial stuff, so we need to remind you guys to hit the bell thingy too as well. Hit the bell button because to to signal to YouTube that this is an important channel and you should not be. Um, 
suppressed. But thank you, Beach. Thank you, Matt. Thank you, Andrew, AGA, Michael Sherlock, Yuval, everybody that I didn't mention, Andrew, Soraya. Um, oh, the Abraham who, who gave us super chats. Um, so yeah, thank you guys, and thank you to our co-hosts, Shapam, Susanna, and Rivka. See you guys again next week. Bye. Bye. News. Thank you for joining us. Subscribe to our channel. Hit the bell thingy. If you haven't, I don't know why. What has what's holding you back? Okay. If you haven't subscribed to our channel. Why haven't you subscribed to our channel? Explain that to us, please. Like, bell, <laughs> and also, if, you, if you're not getting notifications and stuff because YouTube is not telling people that we have shows because YouTube is like, oh, this person told us that they want to get your shows, right? They want to get your videos, but nah, you, we think it's no. And oh, look, oh, they also hit the bell button. But nah, you guys are too controversial. We want to show them mainstream stuff. We want to show them CNN or cat videos or whatever. But even there are people are like, no, we want to see Atheist Republic. And YouTube is like, no, nah, we don't think you want this. They're like, no, please show it to us. We say to you, we want to see Atheist Republic. And YouTube is like, no, we think we know what's better for you than you yourself. So to solve that, link, there's a link in the description, uh, which is to our newsletter. So hopefully some of our, we could email it to you. So hopefully you get some of our content that way. Okay. So yeah, subscribe to our newsletter as well and share, share our videos because you know, we do get demonetized. That's an obvious on every one of our videos. So F that, but we don't care about that anymore, <laughs> but we also get deprioritized and that's even more damaging to us. Deprioritized. What does that mean? That means we're not, we don't show up on the suggested, you know, videos on the right and all that, you know, on the, on people's homepages. And that's how channels grow. Unfortunately we can't grow. So we need you guys to share our videos. 